as Europe scrambles to control COVID-19. Warnings from Denmark of a new strain of the virus. Health authorities supported by the military have begun culling the country's entire population of up to 17 million mink after a mutation of coronavirus found in the animals spread to humans. We get uh, told it yesterday that we should gas all of us mink and so we start today 7 o'clock so we can do it fast as we can and I hope we can do it in 10 days. More than 200 people in Denmark are now infected and the numbers are rising. Health authorities have observed a serious development in the coronavirus in infected mink. Infections have been found on 207 mink farms, and this development has taken place despite intensive efforts to limit the spread of the infection. What's worrying scientists is that the new strain showing decreased sensitivity against antibodies, meaning vaccines currently under development to treat COVID-19, might not be able to stop it. The World Health Organization's praised the decision, saying Denmark showed determination and courage despite the huge economic impact on mink farmers. The move is likely to devastate the country's pelt industry. Mink have also been culled in the Netherlands, US and Spain after infections were discovered. The Dutch government said it was speeding up its timeline for shutting down all of the country's mink farms. China is also one of the world's largest producers of pelts. Beijing's made no announcements about changes to its industry. The virus mutation in mink has confirmed scientists' fears that multiple strains of coronavirus can emerge simultaneously. Winning the war against one doesn't mean destroying them all. Neve Barker, Al Jazeera.